I'm Tony Scar with BNET TV. We're here at Showstoppers during IFA 2011 in Berlin, Germany. I'm speaking with Mr. John Horan from Texas Instruments. How are you today, sir? Great, thank you. Fantastic. Listen, for our first time viewers, why don't you give us a brief overview of Texas Instruments' position within the ecosystem as it pertains to IFA and here at Showstoppers. So at IFA and Showstoppers uh, for Texas Instruments, we're here representing the DLP organization, which sells image processing uh, chipsets into different markets of uh, digital cinema, TV, front projection, and classroom, conference room, and a new market of Pico projection. Pico projection in the projector world is defined as any projector, front display, uh, below 500 lumens. So, you know, Pico projection is uh, definitely something that's new to the, to the marketplace, relatively, and of course uh, has a fantastic um, enterprise application uh, to it. Everybody's trying to get their hands on it to something that is, has the ability to be able to utilize in the proper fashion without it just being just another flashlight. Right. What can you tell me about that? So, the Pico projection market covers a, a pretty wide breadth of, yeah. from embedded into a, a handset or a camera camcorder up to a uh, attachment to a laptop. So there, there's a pretty good, there's a wide range in between there, ranging, you know, a 10 lumen product up to a 500 lumen product. At Showstoppers this year, we're demonstrating pretty much that whole gamut of products. From, uh, we have a new product from Nikon, actually just introduced uh, last week. It's a Coolpix uh, projector, and it's got a uh, projector with DLP technology inside, uh, 20 lumens and uh, VGA resolution out in the market very soon. It's a very nice product. It's a, it's a great family uh, camera. Take the picture, turn it around, show it on a wall. It's a, it's a great image. And then we go uh, also at the show, we're showing, so this starts in the lower end from the lumen standpoint, um, but also in a unique form factor. Uh, for sure inside the camera. We're also showing a 50 lumen product from Acer that attaches directly to your laptop through USB. Your content and your power comes from the USB, so that's the only thing you carry is one very light weight uh, projector that's 50 lumens, wide VGA resolution, uh, just a great image, very simple to use. Is, uh, is this style of product something that we're going to see resonating within the consumer marketplace this holiday season? I think that yes, uh, absolutely. You're going to see products. Actually here at the show, Philips is launching a line of uh, Pico projectors with DLP products. We're demonstrating an 80 lumen product that can work off of both uh, standard wall power or battery power. And it's a, uh, again, it's a wide VGA resolution, 80 lumen on the wall power, 50 lumen battery power, but it's, a, it's also a stunning image in a small package. And I, that's gonna be geared both inter enterprise, it's like buy for work, take home for play, but there's gonna be a lot of buy for play as well on it. Um, and then I think you're gonna see in the enterprise side of it, uh, we just introduced our wide XGA chipset or HD chipset and you're going to see a lot of products being launched on that in the next uh, couple of months. Here at the show, we're, we're highlighting uh, a, uh, a Vivitech Cumi product, 300 lumens, very small, elegant form factor. Um, and then one of the things I did want to show, this is the, talk about the evolution of Pico projection over three years. Uh, three years ago, Dell launched this projector a point, this was a uh, SVGA projector, 50 lumens. This year in October, they're gonna launch a projector that's almost equivalent in size, wide XGA resolution, but over 250 lumens. Wow. Five times the brightness, same form factor, three years. That's one of the things that really gets me excited about Pico projection and the future. Wow, that's extremely impressive. Same form factor, but so much more power. Right, and we're seeing that all over the place. Uh, the Nikon 20 lumens, 2x the brightness of a lot of embedded products that are out there uh, today. The, uh, um, we're going to see products launch from Optima here at the show that, that we're in form factors of 50 lumens, it'll be 100 lumens. 
uh, form factors that were 200 lumens, it'll be 500 lumens now. So really this year is, is a big jump in a lumens um, per pound or lumens per cc volume for sure. I think that you've just defined the new commodity for 2012. John, thanks very much for taking right. the opportunity. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. I've been speaking with John Horan from Texas Instruments about Pico projection here at Showstoppers during IFA 2011 in Germany. I'm Tony Sklar with BNET TV.